what a great, great kid he was. Police say Timber and his 26-year-old brother Jonathan were stabbed to death at a home in York Township around 6 a.m. Saturday morning. Family members say Timber and Jonathan were with their mother, Vicki Moore, and were staying with friends before going to a race at the Michigan International Speedway. Community members, including Timber's middle school track coach in Indian River, are in shock tonight. We're going to miss him, and I do know that this community may be small, but we rallied together, and we'll just have God by our side through this. Vicki Moore is a regular at this Blarney's Castle gas station and would often stop in with her son, Timber. Saddening. <laughs> Not only, you know, for the family more so, but to think of how close it is to your own family and what the family is going through. And like I said, I have, he was really good friends with my nephew and I have kids around, you know, a son around the same age. So it's sad to, I couldn't imagine. I really couldn't imagine if it was my kid. It just hurt for the family. State police say in all five people were stabbed during the attack. Investigators today said they do have a person of interest that they are looking for. 12 years old, you know, the way I look at that is, you know, people probably question how can something so evil happen, but, you know, we live in a fallen world and evil affects us. Even when there's good people, it's all around us and um, he's in a better place. I mean, gosh, I mean, he's at peace now and his life affected all of us in a positive way and it will continue to with the memories we have of him. In Sheboygan County, Charlie Lapistora, ABC 29 and 8.